Here's a group of Moonglow Sweet Bay Magnolia. This is Magnolia Virginiana. It exists in uh, many land races in the uh, eastern and southeastern part of uh, the U.S. But what's unusual about this year, even though the wind is howling right now, is these plants have kept their foliage all winter. It's now almost the 1st of February, and it won't be long before they start unrolling uh, their bud sheaths at the top of the uh, stem. Here you can see where the, uh, the new foliage emerges. I've got three plants. They're each uh, slightly different in size. The largest one probably about 15 feet tall. But the nice thing about this magnolia is it blooms on and off all summer, starting in early summer. Uh, in a favorable year, it'll even make a beautiful uh, uh, orange-red seed pod. It's actually the, uh, uh, the seeds that uh, drape from the pod themselves, pods themselves, uh, that provide the color. The pods are more cone-like. Amazing. And again, the weather changes at this time of the year. I uh, didn't quite expect to uh, have the thunderstorms we had overnight again, the third week of January, and then the howling winds and temperature drop today, but uh, until the weather settles in uh, uh, probably uh, April or even May, uh, just about anything is possible. But again, nice to see moon glow, Magnolia virginiana, uh, not only in this area, but native to southern Illinois and uh, eastward and southward, keeping its leaves all, all winter long. And isn't this beautiful? The, the silver color just really pops. I almost think I want to put more evergreens back here just to uh, pop that silver. Again, here a multi-stem, but it can be trained to a single stem as well. That day breaking free I saw my future staring back at me